Hello and welcome back to Mrs. Reasonable Beauty. Today I have a Bath and Body Works haul for you and I am so excited to share it with you because I went kind of crazy and bought a lot of lotion. <laughs> so judge me at the end of this video because you'll probably be like, oh my gosh, not another lotion. But I'm going to start with something that's not lotion. This first pick was something my husband picked and this is a candle called Mint Chocolate and it smells like mint chocolate chip ice cream. It smells amazing. And it says it's a semi-sweet chocolate, dark cocoa and peppermint with vanilla cream and white chocolate. And it smells oh just heavenly. It makes me want to eat it. <laughs> but that was his pick. He had originally said absolutely no more candles and then he smelled this one and he fell in love. So Bath and Body Works is addicting. You should know. We also got some wallflowers. We got the mint chocolate, which is his favorite scent in the candle, obviously, and a caramel apple. And everything I bought was on sale, like majorly on sale. The candle was 50% off. I, I believe these were both 50% off. My big splurge, and that is lotions. Um, for those of you who know, for those of you who don't, I'm pregnant. And I have been um, itching terribly. For those pregnant women out there, you know your skin starts to stretch and the elasticity starts to flex and all kinds of craziness. And I just want to rub myself with lotion 24 hours a day, 7 days a week. And I have actually been going through lotion like crazy for the first time in my entire life. So... I went kind of crazy when the sale came on because these are originally $11 and they were 75% off which knocked it down to like two seventy five, dollars something like that. So it was crazy. So I got a bunch of them. First one I got is Berry Flirt and this is Voluptuous Red Berries Flirt with Blonde Woods to Make Them Swoon. And I've learned that I can't squeeze them and smell them because... I get it up my nose. But this just smells like berries. It's the Sweethearts collection. And that smells incredible and good and I love berries. So that got added to the collection. Wild Peach Poppies. These all have vitamin E and shea butter in them which is supposed to be really good for your skin. Um, this one doesn't have a description. Da -da 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 -da. Oh. It's a wild peach poppies, a fragrant burst of fresh peach blossom, sunlit poppies, and sugared musk. I smell the poppies. I don't smell anything else, like the musk or the peaches. I mean, I guess it kind of smells sweet, so I'll give it to them. And then we have the Ke Capri Seaside Citrus, which I have a... Um, which I have a lip gloss in this and it's a glittery lip gloss. This has different, uh, wow, this has a bunch of them. This is the top scents are Mediterranean Grapefruit Sparkling Bergo, Bergamo, I don't know, Juicy Nectarine, Mugo, Orange Flower, Coconut, and the Dry Amberwood, Creamy Musk, and Whipped Vanilla. So let's smell this. To me, it kind of smells like suntan lotion with fruit. Suntan lotion with fruit. <laughs> I am not the best at describing scents, so if you want a wonderful scent description, end here. But if you want to stay and listen to me dry, good for you. P.S. I Love You is one I have right now, and I absolutely love this scent. Um, I don't even know what it smells like. It's an unforgettable blend of golden amber and fresh rose. And I don't think it smells... I think it smells more like the amber than the rose. But I have a bottle of this right now that is down to here. So I was in desperate need and my husband's like, hey, they're only $2.75. Get another bottle. Why does he support my habits like this? Why? <laughs> and then I got Orange Sapphire. Orange Sapphire, 
actually, we used to use this on patients when I worked at the hospital. It just has a very fresh citrusy scent. I mean, obviously, it's oranges. Inspired by fiery passion and sun-swept beaches of Brazil, which I don't think that inspires me at all. But, this smells amazing. It smells very fresh, and I will not have a problem wearing any of these. The next one is the Rome Honeysuckle Amore, or Amore, however you want to say it. I'm trying to be all French with it. This has the top sense of Italian peach, blackberry, green mandarin, mid pink honeysuckle, white raspberry, and peony, and dry golden amber, soft sandalwood, and cypress wood. And that smells really good. I smell honeysuckle. That's what I smell. And that's supposed to be one of the mid scents. But it smells amazing. Next, I got the Wild Berry Tulips. I smell berries. This is a flirtatious blend of red raspberry, sheer honeysuckle, and pink tulips. And that smells really good. Most of the ones I got are white. I noticed that. I have two pinks, a purple, and a blue. And a majority of them are white. I wonder if they sell a majority of white. I don't know. I just noticed that. I'm not trying to be prejudiced or anything. This is the Rio Rumberry. And I think... I don't know what it smells like. It's a blend of tropical berries, fresh papaya, and vanilla blossom. I don't know. It smells good. It smells kind of fruity. Maybe it's the berries I'm smelling. Then I got the Venice Dolce Berry. Are you notice the trend with the berries here? This has a top scent of pink plumberry, apple blossom, white iris, Venetian raspberry, red apricot, frosted magnolia for mids, and for dries, blackberry musk, sandalwood sugar, and vanilla biscotti. I smell berries and flowers, which is good because the top one's a plum berry, apple blossom, and white iris. So yeah, there's that. And then we finally reached our final lotion. Oh my gosh, guys, thank you for hanging in there till the end because I know this is a lot of lotion. But the last lotion is Secret Wonderland, and I love this. I got a sample of this at Christmas. Maybe? I don't know. It was a gift. It was a travel size. And I thought it smelled wonderful. It's supposed to be a thrilling blend of luscious strawberry, frosted jasmine petals, and white amber. And I think, gosh, it smells so good. I think it's the jasmine that makes it just smell so delicious to me. But it's beautiful. I love it. I got a total of... 10, I think. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, yeah. 10 lotions, which I know y'all are probably thinking I'm crazy, but it's because I'm pregnant. I'm going to blame most of my videos for the next, like, while on me being pregnant. So I hope you enjoy these kind of videos, and I hope you come back to see me soon. This was a great, great haul for me. I absolutely loved it. So this is Mrs. Reasonable Beauty and make sure you keep checking out my videos and I promise I will keep them coming now because it's a goal for me. Make it happen. Leave a comment below. Hit the like button. See you guys later. Hello and welcome back to Mrs. Reasonable Beauty. Today I am going to be doing a drugstore haul. It's not a huge one. It is actually kind of a small-ish one, but it's still a haul. So I wanted to share it with you guys. First thing I got, and I'm actually getting ready to do a first impressions video on it, is the CoverGirl CG Smoothers BB Cream in light, or fair to light, number 805. And I actually have it on right now. Um, 